Well, as you can see, we have been camping out with a few people in the parking lot <laughs> of the Blue Water Casino. And we are getting ready to head out right now. We are going to go do a few chores and then we are heading to the slabs. We're gonna go meet up with a few people there and then from there we're not sure what our plans are but of course whatever they are we'll let you guys know and it's just gonna be another travel day and hopefully we can find some good things for you guys to see so stay tuned So we fixed the hot water tank and finally we can take a shower in our rig. Took a little longer than had expected. First I thought it was a thermal coupler. Came to be that that wasn't the case. It was the um, whole propane thing, the, the whole uh, adjusting valve. And so I put that in and what I had done earlier was take out the pilot light tube, which I think I lost a jet that went in it. So needs to say I'll show you how it looks now. They, the, the stuff we had original was outdated, so we got the new control valve. This is all the same, and then I had to get these two new hoses. This is a thermal coupler, but this came together as one. Um, what I had done earlier on the other one was I disconnected the propane or the pilot side, and then I turned on the valve, and all of a sudden I could hear lo all kinds of fuel going. Well, what I had done was lost. I assume was a jet. There's, I'm, and I wasn't going to pull this one, this new one apart to make sure. But now everything works great. Uh, updated version. Uh, we were also told that the old one was a fire hazard, so maybe it was a blessing that this all did happen. Uh, here, after a while, I'm going to take the plastic plug out, and I will go and get a. Um, uh, the one with the zinc tube on it and everything and have that done and I might even get one, the one that has the valve on it, the little petcock valve so to drain it I can just hit that valve. I think that was only uh, 12 or 13 bucks so everything is fixed here. Mr. Um, Russ helped me out uh, with getting this and also um, to get the thing fired up because what I was doing was I was having the pilot on and I had my other old glasses on so I'd have the pilot going and then I would turn the valve to turn it on and I kept turning it to off. And so I'm staring in here and I'm going, I'm, and I'm looking at Russ and I'm going, why is this thing, every time I touch it, it keeps turning off. It's, I haven't done anything good. And then he looks at me and says, are you turning it the right way? So, put my glasses on and yep, I was turned the wrong way. So now it all works and I'm just happy. So once again, Always something on the road to fix. Um, here in Parker, this is a really busy place because you can get your gas, diesel, you can get your propane filled, and you can get your water, and in the store you can get things too. So this little um, shell station is pretty busy um, on most days. But this is the busiest in the propane line that I've seen. Um, when we're here, but the water place is always pretty full. We are heading off and we'll, the first place that we'll probably stop and get out and take a look at things is in Glamis. So welcome, be safe, 
and legal. There's the rules. They want to make sure you don't lose your season permits. Glamis Road. The railroad put Glamis on the map. Highway 78 and OHV Recreation kept it there. Imperial Sand Dunes Recreation Area. So there's a map of the whole area. I'm assuming where they can uh, ride. You definitely don't want to go in here. Danger, live bombing area. Keep out. <laughs> so yeah, that would not be that would not be a good place to ride. And then they just have another safety board here telling you that you need to use your protective apparel, skill level, vehicle condition, terrain, weather, common sense, and follow area rules. All affect your safety, right? At your own risk. <laughs> okay, that's a workout. Here come the boys and their toys. your first time to California yep. and your first time to the dunes. Absolutely love it. Yay, right on. I'm glad that we got to do this with you. I Thank think it's you fun. Very much. You're welcome, Thank always. You always. All right, well that was fun to put our feet in the sand and uh, get back out here for the second time in our lifetime. And again, watch other people enjoy themselves with their off-road yes, vehicles in the sand. Got, we got so lucky because of Lisa, so we Absolutely. have no complaints here whatsoever. Ooh, trying to hold the big camera now. I, my, my GoPro went dead, the so I'm using California the big one. 78. California 78. All right, we're heading off to Briley. Gonna get some groceries there. Oh, you're really faded out from the sun. Sorry, guys. And we'll see you guys in Briley. So we should be there in about 39 minutes.
Uh-oh. Very light. <laughs> All right, guys. we got to make this quick because of the music. We made it to Slabs, and we will talk to you guys tomorrow. We are here in Slabs. Love you guys. Bye. Peace out. Finished Johnny said, well, you're pretty good, old son.